One, two, three. Ta-da! All right. Can we start her up? <laughs> the OV-10 Museum, the B-36 Peacemaker Museum, and the Fort Worth Air and Space Museum have come together to celebrate the 100 years of flight in Fort Worth. And today, we're celebrating the airships, the dirigibles. This engine actually uh, belongs to the Smithsonian Institution, as I understand it. And uh, the Smithsonian said, well, y'all can keep it there in Fort Worth and keep it in your museum. Uh, I don't think anybody wants to come get it, so uh, it's here in Fort Worth, and it's it's a it's a good link to Fort Worth history with uh, dirigibles and zeppelins and that era of aviation. At the time, the dirigibles were the uh, the super weapons of mass destruction, and they were filled with hydrogen gas, and more often than not, uh, an incendiary bullet would make the dirigible just explode and burn up. The Navy built four dirigibles, and um, this engine was built for one of them. It never did fly on one, but it was used as a test bed. There was only three of these engines built, and we're lucky enough to have one in Fort Worth. I think their passion is going to drive a greater vision for commemorating air in Fort Worth and I think it's going to be one of the catalysts that moves that along to the point when we have a world-class museum to remember the amazing links to aviation history that are right here in Fort Worth, Texas.